this is Charles Eugene Jackson, one of the scientists in the science observatory room. And it's very nice in here. We have a lot of supplies. We're learn we're trying to figure out what this rock is. So if you wanna come a little closer or inside the house, come on ahead. And we're gonna tell you what we have in our house, in our place. So these are special Ed goggles, special goggles you put on your face. So if like stuff gets in your eyes, this will block it. So here's my calculations of this rock. Hey, can you it looks me? like all of these. Can you see them? Don't move your hand. They are very <laughs> funny calculations, I think. Can I put on mine? Well, and here we, we, we have other um, things, like we have a meteorite. We have a sharp Tyrannosaurus Rex tooth. We have two pieces of coal. And, and we are, I'm going to show you the shark goggles. I, sometimes I go out diving, so that's why I have these for me. I only wear these sometimes in here, but sometimes, the rest of the times I use them out. So All right, I'm going to get started. We want to get started on our calculations. All right, let's go. All right. Today, we won't be learning about this rock. Uh, we are going to be learning about this. It will break if you, like, hit it on something. But that's okay. It's formed in Earth thousands of years ago from sediment and dirt piling up. It could have been found under the ocean where there is water now. That's because millions of years ago, the water washed away and went into the Earth. So then we found this formed. Or, for example, there could be a fish fossil in the desert. How surprising! How surprising! There was water there! Millions and millions of years ago. So we're going to be learning about fossils today. We each have a dinosaur tooth. And there's a lot of calculations of, of dinosaurs that um, scientists found. They find these because they are going digging for different things. This TV show is created for kids to learn about science and we want them to really be happy and enjoy us being on TV. Don't so videotape me. I'm going to put dinosaurs on here and mark it in my book. We're going to look up all the different kinds of fossils and what fossils are. Does he need to look at you? And if... And this thing is called a microscope. So, I only let my brother catch on it because I got it on my sixth birthday. Hey, okay. Has everybody heard about the children's encyclopedia? Yes. Um, 
And so, you know, there is so much facts in there. In fact, I think I just found dinosaurs. Actually, here I'll go get something. No, we found diamond. Let me read about the diamond. Diamonds are crystals. They are harder than anything else in the world. They are. Formed by great heat and pressure deep beneath the surface of the earth. Diamonds are made of pure carbon. The same mineral that is found in ordinary coal. And actually, let me show you an actual chunk of coal. Actually, I have two, but I'm going to show you guys. They are different shapes. They are different sizes. Coal pieces can can come off, so be very careful with them. There is a lot scientists learn about the Earth. Well, most of the scientists learn about space. Space is a big thing. Oh, you've heard of outer space. Do you got p little children think about about aliens in space? Yes. Well, actually, if you read books, they might say there's aliens in space, but there's really not. There's really not. It's all because of the the universe. They wouldn't be able to, nothing would be able to live on a different planet. So, real fast. Here is my backpack. I'm not going to show you any pictures in this one because I have one that's going to be a last time. I'll show you a picture. Of this. There's ocean. Fossils, and there's dinosaur pictures too. And here's cats. I really like cats, and that's why I wanted to show you in place. Those cats are the the ones we're allowed to like have as pets. And bye. See you next time, everybody. Oh, out of